Steve Knight. Chris Daniels will now take that 10th spot in the upcoming UWA television title tournament. But these two teams now vying for a spot. We know that the tag... Leave it. Bride. That is slander. I think simply what had happened was uh, Phil Powers, yes, Phil Powers had used Mad Dog's brush without asking. Well, here come a team, Steve, that we don't know very much about. Joey Knight and Roman Nightwing, the all-nighters. <laughs> and I think we can tell, just from looking at them, that they're Canadian and they're proud of it. There's nothing much to be proud of, really, is there, Kenny? Well, I don't know about that. We've seen some great wrestlers come out of Canada, but these two seem more like two clowns. What are they doing? Well, I don't know, Steve, but I think Paul Terrell and Steve Morocco are going to give them a hell of a match tonight. Well, I certainly hope so, Kenny. Over recent weeks, we've seen a number of our foreign friends come over here and wrestle. Most notably last week, the fallen angel Christopher Daniels, who I thought was a disgrace. Well, of course, Christopher Daniels, as we saw last week with that, the interference from Steve Knight, Chris Daniels will now take that 10th spot in the upcoming UWA television title tournament. But these two teams now vying for a spot. We know that the tag team titles for the UWA, the first ever UWA tag team champions, are going to be decided in Blackpool just a few weeks from now. And uh, both these teams really want to make their mark. Show the UWA officials Japan. <laughs> Over recent weeks, We've seen a number of our foreign friends come over here and wrestle. Most notably last week, the fallen angel Christopher Daniels, who I thought was a disgrace. Well, of course, Christopher Daniels, as we saw last week with that, the interference from Steve Knight, Chris Daniels will now take that 10th spot in the upcoming UWA television title tournament. But these two teams now vying for a spot we know that the tag team titles for the UWA, the first ever UWA tag team champions, are going to be decided in Blackpool just a few weeks from now. And uh, both these teams really want to make their mark, show the UWA officials what they're capable of, so that they can make sure they get the shot at the tag team titles. Well, Kenny, you know I'm a clean living young man. You know that, and I appreciate fair play. I just hope that the all-nighters play fair, unlike that yank Christopher Daniels well we're about to see just what kind of match we're going to get out of these people Paul Terrell and Steve Morocco we know very very gifted athletes they had a very tough match against the death squad just a few weeks ago here on UWA wrestling rampage and they lost it was a close match but uh, here they have a chance to redeem themselves by beating their international counterparts And speaking of international superstars, we've got them from all over the world here in the UWA. We saw Chris Daniels last week from the US. We're seeing the all-nighters right now from Canada. And of course, later on today, we'll be seeing Grand Naniwa versus Tiger Mask, all the way from Japan. <laughs> Lovely move there. One of the all-nighters there strutting his stuff. But here come, the, here come Too Far Gone with a double kick. And now a big double suplex taking down one of the all-nighters. I'm not sure which one that is, but they hip toss the other one. We have Knight and we have Knight Wing. I'm not sure which is which. Like I say, I don't know these teams well. As Terrell and Morocco go with a couple of arm drags there. And now, double baseball slide takes <laughs> down both all-nighters. Kenny, you've got to admit these boys have had they've been through the heart family dungeon as Paul Terrell with a massive broken by Mad Dog McPhee during a match just a few weeks ago Mad Dog of course now has had that training in the scrapyard that we saw last week 
Yes, and viewers, we will be able to shed some light on the murky wrestling underworld run by Dino Scarlo later in the show. Thanks to Kenny McBride, who's been quite the investigative journalist. Kenny, you're a man of many talents. Well, thank you, Steve. And here goes Paul Terrell now. Takes one of the all-nighters up. Big body slam. Folks, we've got to take a commercial break. We'll be right back. <laughs> Welcome back, wrestling fans. We're back with the action here on UWA Wrestling Rampage as the All-Nighters going to work on Paul Terrell and Steve Morocco. Here he comes. We think this is Joey Knight with a big spinning dive off the apron. You know, seeing the All-Nighters wrestle here...